But there's some kind of random encounter we'll encounter when we go to the camp. You have been waylaid by enemies and must. Well, it's not exactly random if you encounter it every time, but anyway. Two kill giants have a cornered a juvenile green dragon in this clearing. Okay, that sounds pretty bad. You called? For the group. For the group. You there, Elf. Come to my aid and I will make it worth your while. Such is the way of nature. The strong survive and the weak perish. We should not eat. Uh, so basically, take down the giants to get some kind of information or just let things happen. Uh, the auto attack system is attacking the giants already though. Right. Ahira said we should not interfere and then you start attacking. I don't see any reason why the giants would have basically helped me in any way. So why I don't expect the green dragon to be in any, of any real use. I expect it to still be more useful than uh, letting things just happen on their own. So you are not worthless after all, Emma. Very well, I will keep my word. Days ago I spotted warp concealing something in the rocks piled to the northwest. Something shiny. I intended to retrieve it myself, but you did aid me in my time of need. Yes, it is yours. Take it, but do so quickly, lest I change my mind. Oh, we're gonna disappear. I reacted to it threatening. Yes. Uh, I don't have room for this. Well, the positive side isn't gonna eat too much of my time either, so we can go and uh, finish up the spider nest. I also. So it's a helmet for people who can't wear helmets. Dexterity plus one, weapon speed factor plus two. Rogue will probably get the most out of it, I would imagine. He also has. Uh, he also also has a helmet. So which one of our mages wants it? Uh, we got an armor class increase out of it, and uh, open speed factor, so we can waste our ammunition and look faster. For the group. For the group. Yes. I can carry no more. With caution.
is good as done. Or the group. Or the group. Uh, we're gonna rest anyway, so I might as well pay ace my ass. Nature's servant awake. For the group. So we're do a, going to do a quick shopping thing. Rest. And get back there. I have many fine wares. What weapon are you using? You have an extra mace plus one, mace plus two. You might switch this away from this character though. Mm, probably not though. Holding on to equipment pieces like that just in case you might possibly maybe need it later. That's uh, that's what leads you to problems. It might happen, but still, it's a uh, unlikely thing to happen. I think the failed phylactery is was only a clue about what the real phylactery looked like when we faced the lich, and it has no other purpose. But if we can store them in a pack of holding, it doesn't particularly matter. It can hold a lot of crap. Holding on to the elven chain mail, it's unlikely we're going to see another one of them. So if we want to have a use for it later, we definitely have to have it. I don't expect to see a use for it later though, but... Um, wouldn't be the first time I've been wrong about something. Another potion case, probably warranted. Gym bags, we already have two, that's gonna be enough. Front guy has to have the bag. All the weird stuff that you don't know what to do with goes in the bag. I'm holding on to some weaponry because I'm pretty sure this isn't gonna be the final group we are gonna go with, so. I would love to have extra weapons once we have the final group in that the final group decided. We could possibly have better equipment for some people already, but uh problem being I'm not sure I want to go through these. Go through the inventory just to spot some kind of a Absence somewhere. We can certainly buy certain type of items for certain people. Belts, girls, rings, boots, that sort of stuff. Also, maybe start shoving ammunition into some other containers.
I mean, we even if it's just here, we're not using these slots, and we're not using really darts anymore either. The standard issue dart we have now is more than enough for like vast majority of the cases or encounters we encounter. So I'm not really sure. Sure, I see the point. Crimson Dawn. Fifteen percent chance per kill of haste in the wielder for three rounds. Don't really have a katana user. It's a good weapon though. Probably gives us a decent amount of cash then. Uh, the problem is, I don't know. Again, same goddamn problem. Uh, do I have the necessary equipment for the guys I'm hoping to bring in? And I don't know. Uh, still, we need to be able to different differentiate between crap we want to get I'm rid of and stuff we so want much. to hold on to. I have dropped it. Now, Jahira is gonna. Everything we put in Jahira's inventory is gonna be sold off, I think. Arts of Stunning. You already have 80. Wait. Probably should start using them. I'm not gonna use a plate mail plus one. The shield is probably better than some we have. Yeah, medium shield plus one is better. <sighs> Acid arrows. Thirteen thousand again, so we could afford another bag of holding. I think we're going to start looking for extra containers, but also extra usables. I need to bring my reputation up a little bit, and so forth. Maybe some uh, attack wands. If we buy them, they're expensive as all hell, but they also have a huge amount of charges. I'm not sure that now is the good uh, at the right time. Everything's too expensive. We could at least bring the price down uh, by ten percent. Doesn't sound like a lot, but it'll save a lot of cash. Also, we want to get into the settlement that's close by here to see what type of uh, options they have as far as uh, equipment or uh, equipment pieces are concerned. For six hours, target is immune to petrification. Hmm. Again, one of those things that we might never need, but it's not that expensive. And with one or two of those, it doesn't matter what type of petrification using a point to your face, going to face. It can never be a problem.
Alright, I'm hoping for something a bit more interesting. Maybe protection spells. Usually we don't use these, but uh, we might have special needs. One turn per level. The duration is basically fairly long. One turn translates to one minute per level. So we could get a good ten minutes out of playing time out of a single spell. Uh, let it go for now. Spider Bros. You have some mighty muscles there, mistress. As you direct. Should I put in poison immunity or not? I don't think we're gonna get a better situation than this, and I do have money for extra ones if I really really want to buy more immunities. I'm more interested in though seeing if it's a large area or a single or the room. Group. If it's a single room, I don't venturing. think so. It's, it's very small. I don't think there's any point in uh, putting a long duration protection on anyone. We're going to go invisible and just take a look around. You have to be concerned about one thing though, it is possible that uh, there's some kind of automated scripting trigger that uh, initiates dialogue, that will mean the invisible creature will be revealed automatically. We're yep. In the murk of the cavern lies a pile of eggs, behind translucent shells, monstrous arachnids stir. You sense that they will soon awaken. Great. Small spiders to the side of me. What? There's a lot of small passageways. Great spiders. Space spiders, time spiders, sword spiders, small spiders, gargantuan spiders, and eggsy wexies. I think if there's a fight it's gonna start here, it's basically going to bring in all of these seven leg spider. Something I can pick up here, and I don't know what it is. Seven-legged spider seems like the likeliest one to be there, some kind of specialty spider here. Yeah, it's the only that's truly unique. I'm not quite sure how I wish to handle this. One at a time, maybe that's how they want to fight this. I sort of have a feeling it's not gonna go that easily. That they're going to swarm out once we start fighting. Maybe done. some of the eggs will start first too. I I'm busy right I now. called I shall. 
We can adapt, but let's try just straightforward blasting them with all hell first. Yes. So you say. I shall. Violet, prepare for thy whatever thy wills. Feel my power. To Fight or flee, either way you fall. For the group. For the group. Right. So every room probably has a uh, magic trap yes. of similar type. As good as done. We could easily conquer that. Keep watch for ancient tombs or any scrolls that might contain lost arcana. So, this could have been an interesting fight, but since they're allowing me to sort of handle them one at a, one group at a time. It, there's no point having any kind of immunities here. Might get poisoned a couple of times, but uh, not gonna matter. Sword first. We only have 10 plus pure antidotes, then some health potions or health elixirs to kill. Who doesn't like antidotes. this place? He had a bad experience with a web once. <laughs> he does not want to talk about it. We have plus two bastard sword. And I forgot to sell my jewelry. There's probably tens of thousands of worth of those too. That's not a really big concern though. Because we want to see the smith first. Plus 5 hit points, 15% chance per hit of draining 1d4 hit points from the target and transferring them to the wielder. This will not heal beyond the wielder's maximum. It does not affect undead, construct, or extra player creatures. So it's an okay weapon that we don't particularly have a use for at the moment. I suppose this guy, because there, he's equally worthless with every weapon at this point. Yes, all is good as done. Right. An open wound in Mother Earth. I would plug it had I the power. What the fuck are you on about? With caution. Hmm. Your yen? Let's go with I shall. this room first. That's where the stiffest resistance is. I'm gonna go with the cloud kill. We'll probably get rid of the weakest ones directly. Whatever thy wills, see ya. To task. Yeah, they're all dead. As good as done. Incantus. I'm busy right now. Yep. 
is good as done. Mm hmm. Okay, that looks interesting. Looks like a hide armor. Okay, that's exactly what it is. It is rare to see these type of armors. Goblin hide armor. Constitution negative on thieving abilities. If the wielder becomes poisoned, the armor automatically casts low poison on him. Okay, that alone is useful. Usable by Keen. Also unusable by else. Spider egg. This giant arachnid egg is roughly the size of a watermelon, but what rides beneath the soft, clammy shell is not something most would care to eat. Okay, who the hell was spider eggs? Yeah, let's you put it in the bag. What could possibly go wrong? Yes, yes. You bet. Spider corpse. Time spider leg, actually. Why? You could swear this oversized hairy limb just with twitch in your hand. It's unsettling. Okay, so item time is not allowed in a container. Okay. What is this? I keep seeing something there, but uh, it is web silvery grey webbing from a giant spider. Okay. So that's the third item of spider in nature we've got in here. Why? It has to be some sort of a quest. For the group. Yeah, for the group. As good as done. Another spider egg. Murky antidote. Do not want. Okay, there's a thing there that I can pick. Probably web. It's not shown. Yeah, more webbing. Okay, it's spread all over the place. Now that I get a closer look, I'll pick one more. Uh, actually, I'll pick an equal number to the eggs we're gonna get. It's, uh, the slime one egg. protects us in the darkness. As Good thing too, it. cause this place is nasty. <laughs> Ask someone else to task. a reason to hold back, so we're gonna have to rest after this anyway. Nature servant for the fallen! Mm -hmm. As you direct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is gonna hurt by firing. Just stop, 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 stop. Suffer the wrath of the arcane! Healing his ass.
draws close to thee. More one next. That we have support in For the fallen! A wizard's might! <sighs> could have been better, could have been worse. You bet. Still no one died, we got the job done, but, you know, didn't really waste any resources either. Suddenly rhinoceros beetles. As you direct. I think we have more important things to do than this stuff. Cutting from the trampling and che chittering, something very large has entered the caverns. Right. I like you. Best attend the boisterous little beast. Beating blockades is very much her bailiwick. making the stomping sounds. I think I've imagined hearing those stomping sounds earlier. I didn't want to really mention it, I wasn't sure. Uh, I certainly wasn't sure that there was any kind of stomping sound either. Just some kind of weird noise. I've collected spider eggs in case I need them later, okay. Well, that's exactly what I call it, why I collected them. To the games, games got me there. Uh, this seems like a no-brainer, though. Think we have an carefully. infinite ammunition thrower that's fairly competent, so yeah. Bleed. That so many secrets lie buried beneath First, the ground. spiders, then beetles. Best we leave this place before the ink eggs appear. I know beetle shell. Probably something that we're gonna craft in. I'm guessing the spider eggs and things like that could be crafting the bonus in school. I don't know if this bug had a butt, but if it did, it's been thoroughly kicked. Dear yeah. Cloud Shadow, I'm going to be smelling this place forever. Anything more? To task. Or have we categorically conquered this cavern's cornucopia of cockamamie creepy crawlies? For the group. Tis another try, I shall be. Finality. Yes. For the group. For the group. Okay. They still have a decent amount of enemies left, so I think I'll just blow them away. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Okay. As you direct. Uh, I don't really see a point to going back to the camp, but nothing we heard from the camp led us to come here really in the first place, other than the get the war stone. I think the only sensible choice is just keep pushing forward. We need to rest, we can always just rest. But Borisker Bridge is where every, anything worth happening is going to happen. Uh, we should be able to get in the camp. 
because we ate it, the uh, little shits in the temple. As you direct. Uh, that might make. I'm thinking should we just go along the main road then? Now that's what it does. I think we should stay on the main road, otherwise we're just gonna have to kill like huge amount of god no justice. It's not a matter of we that we can or can't fight it, it's just I don't really see what's the benefit for us. It's going to be a lot of fighting that basically has no benefit. Just fighting for the sake of fighting, wasting resources. Ah, a little bit of an interruption there. Or if it uh, goes in the recording or not. Right. Right, the road. As good as done. Mm, we probably should heal up a little bit. We could get into Without the sun, fight. we have no shadows. Simple area of effect heal or group heal should probably cover this. It might not heal all, but heal more or less in fine condition. For the group. For the group. Something you need? Hold. Hold. Who goes there? I seek the one named Karm. Kaherm said that I may find him in the camp here. Oh yes, Kaherm told me you were responsible for his rescue. You have done the crusade a good turn. I'm sure Lieutenant Karm will want to reward you. You'll find him in the camp beyond. May the light shine always upon you, friend. Yay, quest experience. Alternately, probably fight your way through, get from the back or something. Nice, well, we were to get through the front door, so might as well do it. We also have the ability to get into the town itself. We need to steal booze from somewhere. I know you. Uh, I don't think so. Oh, it's, there's too many damn people joining this bloody thing. Okay, okay, I'm Munch, Delgar Munch, right hand of Colonel Cordell. What are you doing now? Hmm. Uh, whatever will lead us in the glorious cause, sir. Currently, I'm cleaning latrines. 
Be about your business then. I didn't want to say that waiting for to attack the town, because I have no idea if they plan to attack the town or not. Very likely, but today. I don't want to say anything that might uh, reveal that I don't have no idea what the hell is going on. Hey, it's you. Thanks again for freeing me. I'm not allowed to call I'm not allowed on patrol for a month, so I guess it all worked out for the best. You. Who are you? Uh, um, found your nephew, sir. Oh, that's right, he described you. The idiot needs a permanent bodyguard to look after him. Still, I'm grateful. Here's a token of my appreciation. Uh, anything I can assist with, sir? I have every available crusader searching for a wardstone. They say it got stolen from the fort, and it'll give us a way inside. If you find it, get it to me, and I'll give you an even more important mission. Seems like a pretty drastic thing for us to give him the ward so though. We want to use to get inside, we don't want to give him the ward stone. So, it seems like we're okay to move around here, so let's go look around. We can. we can. What is this? Why do you disturb my meditations? Uh, have you any magic items for sale? Do I look like a merchant to you? I'm a researcher and a spellcaster, not a trader. Uh, my apologies. There's something else I'd like to ask you. Uh, um, Who are you? Who have the honor of addressing Wiccan, Red Wizard of Fey, loyal servant to the Shining Lady, Kalar Arjun. Yeah. We have the same guy in our group, or the same equivalent. Ah, Dorn is here. Trapped. We should try to free the guy. Let us out, free us out. Open the cages, open. Ignore the trolls. You're nothing but meat to them. I, however, have more to offer if you release me. Yeah, I never thought I'd see you, Cage. What happened? What are you doing here? No, I don't care. Open the cage, free me. And us, let us out too. Silence, vermin. Sentient creatures are talking. What are you waiting for? Release me! Hmm. Yeah, I can't do that yet. I'll return for you when I have done what I need to do. I mean, how would I get him out of here? Not without a fight. You cannot leave me here. Open this cage. Open it, damn you. Nope. Okay, can we just pick everything from the With camp flare. without trouble? Yes. Well. My character says yes, but or I don't think that's a reliable answer. Uh, this is Gorn's uh, gear. Protection versus missile attacks. Armor class immunity to confusion protects against critical hits. Armor class charisma. 
I don't really care about the charisma. He can go in the Berserker mode to get protection against uh, chaos, uh, chaos and things like that. Hopefully he'll get another Berserking attempt soon. I'm not sure if he ever gets one. I so. Single play. attempt sort of isn't enough. At least longer duration for the attempt if nothing else. So we can't loot that. Old Tender Journal. Someone has cobbled together this journal from scraps of parchment and leather, much of it previously used. The new author has crossed out notes on supplies and troop movements and added comments in a scrawled, almost incomprehensible hand. Entry 1 Humans want to pay MIP to kill other humans. That's a good thing, we thinks. This camp full of magic humans who want to tell me about their good gods. We not care about anyone but ye Nagu, but let humans talk. Tall officers say his name, Mor Ali. Teach me to make words on paper. Practice every day. Myth. Myth writes lots so far. Now myth write about me and stupid humans. Give me lots of gold to kill other humans, then take gold back to pack. Entry 6 Leader of humans shine like sun, her name Kalar. Kalar wants to talk trolls, ask me to take trolls. Mip say no, trolls eat us all. Kalar put her hand on Mip's shoulder. Say she say all creatures, gnolls and stupid humans and trolls can serve her like. Kalar's voice nice, but her words make no sense. If it's not in light, trolls will eat us. Entry 8 Myth was right and Kalar was right. How can both be right? Trolls came out of cave ready to eat us all. Then Kalar talks about her light, promises gold and food. Some trolls think this is good, like Myth did. Get lots of gold and take it back to pack. And other trolls yell and say no, stupid. Say Kalar is making a trap. Trolls fight each other, try to eat us. Kalar tries to stop them, says wait, listen to me. Trolls don't listen, just fight. Mip helps kill a troll and set it on fire, but steals an arm to eat, very stringy. Kalar and other humans put nets and chains around trolls. Now they lock up in camp. Kalar tells the brother Hefernan, she is sad. She say, my arrogance caused many an innocent death. Brother say, it's not Kalar's fault, but me think maybe it is. Entry 20 Big ceremony tonight called the lightning, but there was no lightning. Just a big fire and we all chant. Brother started and we said what he said. People yelled that they saw light. Mip didn't see light. There was light inside though. A fire in Mip's chest. Felt hot and strong. Kalar came out and her eyes were like fire. Maybe trolls should have said they were for gold. Entry 24 Kalar marches to Old Castle. She came to Mip and put hand on shoulder again. She smells good, but not like prey. Strong. She said, me, I am counting on you to keep trolls in line. Fire lit up inside again, like the lightning night. We made sure trolls all walk very straight. None eat us. We stopped to camp and Kalar said, good job, me. Ak never says good job, me. Entry 30. On the way to castle, we pass Mip's home. Pack hides in hills. Pockets are full of gold, but me not go back. No, not go to pack. They don't have fire inside, and if Mip left, Kalar would be sad. Who oh, look after trolls? Mip has important job here. If not, let Kalar down.
Mm. Who exactly is Smith? Or Morn. May Kalar's light shine always upon you. Oloneros. Seder Elite. What is it? Well. My mistake. Barak is. Do not question my orders. You there, what are you up to? Uh, looking for a man named Munch. He's an assistant to General Cordell. Well, be about your business then. I don't want to go there. So, pretty much the only thing to come here for is maybe kill some of the wizards and set Dornil Khan free. Everything else seems to be happening outside the gate. I guess we can start with Dorn Ilkhan. What exactly happens if I give them the board stuff? Why would I do that? No, I need to find out where the way where we can use it. That's probably where we need to go after this is settled. That's where the settlement is, so this has to be. I want to talk to the people inside, basically coordinate some kind of effort to, yeah, with the people inside and the people are left outside. Not sure if I'm gonna do it now, but I'd like to at least find out what my options are here for setting out on any specific path. What is it now? You haven't dressed it yet. No, we want pure. Uh, Web it is then. He's the back. Well, that's done. Nature servant away. For the fallen! Too close. webs yeah might as well go for them webs for them. Don't go closer you dumbasses Great leader. And the webbing will hold it in check, even if he saves some. But he's not gonna make three saving throws in a row against webbing. He's good as done. See a couple of wargs still there. Nothing too dangerous though. Your yen?
don't think I have any hard thing spells I could throw there to end this quickly. It is good as done. Fistfuls of flaming finality. And that's it. Right, it seems like there's only a handful of potions there. Yeah, it's pretty pathetic group wise. Just a little bit of a warm up. Yes, as good as done. Right, without a doubt, this is where the board sounds used. Anything else? Yes, beetles. For the <laughs> Take that, wild villain! For the A wizard's mind! Can I go to new areas from this? Gather your party before venturing forth. Means cuts done. Right. At most, there's some kind of a uh, enemy group there, and there's a cave. Right. Wonder if the cave has another entrance that goes into the settlement. You've a task. As you direct. It has a torch, so it's not some kind of creature cave, or at least they're sentient creatures. Fair enough. Let's go take a peek. Hopefully it's nothing major. Oh shit. And? I think emotion hopelessness is our best bet here. Uh, then buff our own group and just kill as many as we can. We do have other means of killing them though, but I don't think that's a good idea here. What we really want is just... Uh, we have to tank this. For the group. Yeah, for the group. Go for the ice pool. Go! First caster, doctor. Your job is to get the caster. Damn. Yeah, they didn't last long in this fight. Feel my power. Suffer the wrath of the arcane. For the group. For the group. Yeah, not, not exactly the kind of fight I was expecting. The numbers make it look a little bit more dangerous than it was. Although, I think if you don't aggressively attack, it could have been in the trouble. They had a caster, they had a decent amount of range and aggress and blood. So, the hits will start raining in, interrupting you, doing some damage. So, you are... You get stuck in the healing cycle. Wasting resources. On the other hand, if you just throw something offensive their way, it just crumbles immediately. There might be something else of interest here too. We might as well check a little more carefully. Circlet. It's a shaman, shamanic circlet, so it's worthless to us, but it might be worth some cash. Caster level plus one, summon spirits are constantly under the effects of the bless spell. Yeah, it's probably upgradable too. Most importantly, it has some decent value to it. And I think that's it. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Alright. 
I think I'll still take a look at that uh, dark area. I don't really expect anything noteworthy to be there, but also don't particularly have a reason not to go and take a look. Okay, that's a spider trap. I don't understand why, because there are no spiders Whatever here. Thy wills. Just Let's talk more fight! So you say. As you direct. Yeah, we definitely need to rest. But if we get in the settlement, that might be enough. For the group. For the group. We don't particularly want to fight while we're pretty. I don't think we have to fight here, so that's why I'm still doing this. My eyelids are as heavy as lead. Or steel. Or gold. Oh, let's say gold. What I mean is, I'm tired. Yeah. Yeah. The siren of sleep sings to me. I've just about seen enough waking hours, slave driver. Magic does not nest well in a tired mind. Ah, I must sleep. <sighs> Who cannot right, stop enough. yawning at this making me? At least we have a better understanding of what our options rest are. When we can we got some a couple of things when we must. done. Not sure what the consequence of that is. What is the, all the spider gear for? We certainly don't have any use for it. Yeah, we did find a companion item piece in the spider cave, so it could be that it's a companion quest of some sort. That's only a possibility. I don't care. I don't have a use for shaman, so we're just gonna miss it if that's the case. I'm still hoping it could be some crafting gear that we can utilize. It appears the defenders have cut the bridge loose. We cannot enter the fort this way. 